was a, uh, a disappointing afternoon over at Widnes. Yeah, definitely. Um, for, for full credit to Widnes, obviously, they stuck it out and played tough, and we just didn't really stick to our game plan and a few, too many errors, but Widnes were good today. They were resilient and didn't give in. Did it show their desperation to, to get the points the way that they threw everything at us? Yeah, definitely. And like, obviously, it's always, it's always going to turn for teams. So if, like, if you had the bottom for so long, you, you'd think you'd become more more hungry for a win. And obviously, unfortunately, today they were, they were hungry than us. In terms of the second game over over this bank holiday weekend, did that take its toll on us in the end? I'm not sure. Uh, I don't think we can use that as an excuse because they, they played Friday as well. But um, I just, like I said, I don't think we stuck to the game plan. Just a few little things didn't go our way. Start of the second half, they had a, a lot of pressure on over. We managed to, to, to defend our away from that, but uh, did that did that eventually wear us down? I think so. I think too much uh, goal line D to me penalties turning it over. I think that played a factor in it, and then we didn't have we didn't have we didn't have the energy in good ball then. Or we, didn't, we, we wasn't in good ball enough. Was the feeling that when we got to 2018 in front that we could hold on with 10 minutes to go? Um, well, yeah. Well, I was on the sideline, but uh, I, I thought we would. Yeah, I thought I thought, like, I thought we toughed it out and grounded out a win but wasn't to be in the end. Lee next up on, on Friday back at home there'll be another side desperate to to get the points against us we need to pick ourselves up straight away from this. Yeah same again uh, John just made, Jimmy Jones just made a good point in change rooms about it's the mentality when you play in teams who are the, towards the bottom of the league who are like really hungry we just, just got to go with that the same mentality as them and Friday's a big game now we need to win to stay in the top four. When I mean, you look at the results around the league probably Cass and Salford apart there's some some crazy results in terms of form teams going into it. It's uh, it just shows how competitive it is now. Yeah, like, like I said, I think there's five or six teams fighting for that top spot. So you got to be on your game every week.